Straight to the deepest secrets of different bills. Hey, don't go dim me, you need it, I got it listed, yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it, yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done, yeah. We from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface. Still, they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you ain't like me. Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is your man, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you. Right now, listen, before we get too far in this video, you know exactly what you need to do. Make sure you drop a like, and let's get this video to at least 1,500 likes, okay? That would definitely push the video to the recommended. And furthermore, if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe. I'm by far the hardest working YouTuber in the 2K community, as I've uploaded every single day since 2K20's prelude, and I've double uploaded every single day since 2K21's prelude. So hopefully you can appreciate that 9 a.m. and that 4 p.m. upload every single day, and you can show that appreciation by dropping a like and subscribing, all right? Now, let's get right into this video. So today we're gonna talk about the glass cleaning lockdown, okay? This is something obviously before next gen, this was basically the build of choice for most people. If it wasn't a glass cleaning lockdown, it was a paint piece, right? But if you wanted to shoot, you made a glass cleaning lockdown. And that's no different here. We're gonna make a dominant build. This build's gonna be able to do everything. It's gonna be 610, 252, 76 wingspan. Definitely wanna go body type to find, all right? Um, when it comes here, what you wanna do is you wanna go on your driving layup, you wanna go 75. On your driving dunk, you wanna go 85. And then on your standing dunk, you wanna go 90. All right and then on your mid-range shot your three-point shot and then your free throw you want to go 60 that'll get you right here you want to skip all your playmaking don't need none of that then you want to max out your interior your perimeter you want to go 59 on your steel max out your block your offensive rebound and your defensive rebound so all that's maxed out so you have a whopping 30 badges and of course here you want to max everything else out get your strength at 90 95 all right your vert at 81 and then your stamina to here all right and then of course you got one more thing left over and he's got to put it there on your speed with ball all right so he's looking at his 9 12 30 so when you're looking at like glass king lockdowns from past years this glass king lockdown is going to be able to get contact dunks driving contact dunks standing big man contact dunks which is crazy all right it's also going to be able to do like i said defensively it's almost like a paint beast right because paint beast is pure this is almost like a pure red but then all of a sudden it's like, yo, this is a pure red with like a, a three-fourth. I mean, you're not going to be able to make a pie chart like this because you're not going to be able to shoot like this. And this build can shoot so good. This is an extremely good glass clean lockdown build, right? Now, you do get a plus four to everything. So you can look at it here. You're, and you're one tick off from getting um 90 driving dunk. But um I don't know if 90 driving dunk even really matters because you're, you're 6'10". So I don't know if... It's going to allow you to get all those um, animations, but I don't know. Maybe we could see if we go one here and then go 86. Let's see what happens if it changes the name. I don't know. But now you'll be able to have 90. So let's see if, you know, get 90 um, driving dunk here. Then you'll have an 86 mid-range shot. You'll have an 84 three-point shot. Um, you'll have a 99 interior defense, which is crazy. You have a 75 perimeter. And that 75 perimeter is going to be very important because, you know, that 75 perimeter defense is associated with your lateral quickness. Excuse me. So... You're not going to be as slow and clunky as uh, most center builds because you're going to be pretty good laterally. Um, obviously, the expectation is not to continuously be on a guard, trying to guard them. But if you have to, you'll be able to hold your ground for a little bit. But you're going to have to be pretty smart with um, how you're defending that individual. 99 um, block, offensive rebound, defensive rebounds is toxic. All right. A 73 speed is really good for a 6'10", 250-pound build. You have a 69 acceleration, a 99 strength, and a whopping 85 vert. The 85 vert is going to be like a game changer. A lot of people just sleep on vert. Vert is extremely important when it comes to rebounding. You just want to be able to get that um, um, these attributes as high as you possibly can. And then, of course, you have stamina at a 92, okay? Um, and you can see as your stamina can only go to a 92, I guess because once you get to a certain height, um, your stamina cannot go to 95. So it's just maxed out at 92, okay? Um... Now, here, we talk about this all the time, man. You gotta go based upon your play style. Um, if you're gonna be a spotter, even though you have slashing, look, you do have slashing to get contact dunks. Like I said, this is pretty OP, right? But most people with this build are probably gonna be um, a spot up, right? No, well, let's just say you're gonna be a spot up. You wanna go spot up first because you're gonna be a spot up for your teammate or whoever you with. Then you got glass cleaning and rim protecting. 
to me, I feel like everybody's getting dunked on all the time. It's just so OP. So that's why I feel like pain intimidation or stuff blocks are going to be the best bet because it's going to at least make sure that no one's going to be driving and getting dunks on you. So I would go like this. All right. Now, if you are somebody that's saying like, listen, you know, I'm not going to be a spot up. I'm going to be more of a pick and roller type. Um, but you're still going to have the, the shooting. So then what I will do is I will go with the finishing moves because this will help you when you roll to the basket to get those contact dunks, alley-oops, and stuff like that. Um, and then I will also go with lip, um, with um, limitless range or, again, going back to one of these pain intimidation joints, okay? So it's your call, all right? It's whatever you're, um, you're satisfied with. But then here you have it, my nephews and nieces here. See, it changed it to a paint beast. I knew it. So let's just go back and put that back at 85. So I knew there was a reason why I had 85, man. So... Let me just go back to 85. So we can't do that. We can't go 86. We got to go 85. All right. Um, let me go back here and do this and this. All right. So then now we have the glass getting locked down. All right. See, you see right there? So that one little change right there changed it. So, um, but this is this will be to give you the glass getting locked down name. So that's the reason why you have to stay at 85 on that and not 86. All right. So now let's do this. Let's go ahead and test this build out real quick. Let's give him a 99. And then, of course, we will get you out of here. Okay. Now, this is a present surprise because now you'll be able to get, first of all, you want to get Rise Up. Um, you want to get Posterizer. Um, and then, what would be another good one? Oh, yeah, let's get put back. Let's get put back, all right? Let's get put back for this build, all right? And then for your shooting, of course, you want to go catch and shoot. You want to go Hot Zone. Um, let's see. Blinders. Um, and Deadeye, all right? Yeah. You could, nah, that'd be it. I mean, only why I would say what he said, shooter, but I just don't think that would be really worth it. All right, hot shot would be another good one too, by the way. Um, if you wanted to change like dead eye out, or whatever, but I think those are just OP. Um, you have no badges here. That's just pretty crazy. People ask me all the time, but yeah, if you click on it, you just get zero. So there's nothing here to get. Okay. Um, now defensively, this one you gotta go crazy with it. Um, just go chase down artists. Um, if you're gonna be setting screens, you gotta go brick wall. Um. Interceptor, get Intimidator, Hall of Fame, um, Rebound Chaser, Pogo Stick, um, Rim Protector. Um, then I will go Box Out, and then I will go Worm. All right, really, really big, important right there. So this is we the stack I'll go. If you're going to be a spot up and you don't need this, then I will probably go with um, uh, what is it? Hot Sopper takes um, Boost Takeover Meter after me. Nah, nah, that that one don't be working, bro. That right there don't be showing the love that I think it should be showing. Defensive leader, boost ability to teammates. You can do that one. Boost plus four to your teammates. Um, or maybe Tyler's Defender. Or you can probably max out Pogo Stick and then get um, Chase Down. Actually, that might be pretty good right here. Okay. But anyway, there you have it, my nephews and nieces. This is the Glass Cleaning Lockdown build. Hopefully, you appreciate this video. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and as usual, your favorite old head, Uncle Demi. I'll be back really, really soon with the banger, man. And you know, when I say back soon with the banger, you already know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about tomorrow, man. I'm out.